Hi, it's Molly. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about my winter skincare routine. I start out morning and night. This is the DHC deep cleansing oil. I have tried every cleansing oil on the market and this is my absolute favorite. I use this in the morning, I put it all over my face, wash my hands, I go make my coffee, whatever, and I let it sink in a little bit if I have the time. And this really gets your pores nice and clean without drying them out. If I don't have time, I just put it on, kind of massage it in, rinse it off. Make sure you have really dry hands when you're using it. I have a whole video on how I use it. At night, if I'm wearing makeup, I will use this as my makeup remover, and then I'll follow up with a Conjac sponge. And look, I just got a nice brand new one. Now, I used to use the one from Julep, and I liked it because it came with a little shower hook, and I kept the shower hook but I started to buy these at Ulta because they're cheap. They're like five bucks. And then I use my Ulta coupons, um, which I have a zillion of. So Conjac sponges are awesome, especially if you have dry skin or sensitive skin like me. They exfoliate without it being harsh in any way. So at night, if I've used makeup, I will use this guy. I use this, you can use it every single day. I use it a few times a week and I feel like it made a really big difference in how exfoliated my skin was. And also they are um, eco-friendly. I don't know why it was so hard for me to find that word. They're eco-friendly, they, they're biodegradable. Wash, exfoliate. After cleansing, morning and night, I use the, the simple I am never, I never can say micellar, micellar water. This is supposed to take your makeup off, but I personally use this for toning because I feel like in the morning it leaves my skin really hydrated and I felt the difference. On the days that I don't use it, my skin feels a lot tighter. And then at night I like this because I feel like it gets all the hair or the, all the makeup off around my hairline if there's any extra makeup on there. So I love this stuff, it's very affordable. I think it's $8 a bottle, you can find it at drugstores. This is my toner. After I have used my toner, I like to put on, this is the extra concentrate, it's from DHC. It comes in a package of five of these. I have fine lines and some lines that aren't so fine anymore. Whenever I use this stuff, I just feel so good about my skin. It's worth every penny to me. I use it in the morning across my forehead and under my eyes and the same thing at night. I also use it around my mouth and I feel like it plumps up the fine lines around there too. So this stuff is really good. I found it when I, when I was in my 20s and I am so grateful. In the morning, I let that sink in again for another minute. I've been using the DHC Q10 eye cream and I just ran out of it so I don't have the bottle anymore. And I've been running through samples because I'm a little sample hoarder. So I don't have that, but I do like the DHC Q10 eye cream. It brightens your eye area a lot. And it makes me look, I don't know. I noticed that after I use it for a week or two, it makes me look more wide awake. After I put on my eye cream, I've been using this. This is La Roche Posay. This is a drugstore brand. This is, I can't even say this. Ath An Thelios. I'm not really sure. It just is, I look for, it's the daily use moisturizer with SPF 15. This is a very nice rich day cream. And I wish that the SPF was a little bit higher. SPF 15 is a super baller, but it's a very good SPF. It's a very nice quality SPF. I love this stuff because when I use it, I do not get a sunburn. This is what I use all, I use, well, I don't use this, but I use this brand as my sunscreen in the summer. It is expensive. This is $40. I do not care because I'm so fair that I hate getting sunburns and I get them the second I go outside. So this stuff I love, I love this brand because it works. You will not get a sunburn and I feel like for your skin on your face, it's also really important because you know, I'll get, if I'm not wearing a good quality sunscreen, I do notice I'll get sunspots, which are kind of, I mean, I feel like sunspots are nature's way of going like, buck up, get a little bit more sunscreen on your face. All right. This is my morning time moisturizer. In the summer, it is way too rich, but in the winter, my skin just soaks it up. At nighttime, I like to use, this is the DHC Olive Virgin Oil, and it is amazing. This stuff just, it soaks in. My skin looks amazing after I use it. 
I notice a remarkable difference when I use an oil versus a moisturizer. When I use a moisturizer on my face, it feels really nice at first, but in the morning I always wake up and my skin looks a little bit taut, a little bit too tight, like it's drying out. And when I use an oil, I wake up in the morning and my skin just looks so nice and normal and balanced. So I highly recommend this stuff. It's another product that I've been using since my 20s and I just, I'm obsessed with it. So I think for dry skin, oils are the way to go. They won't stay in your pillowcase. They sink in right away. They won't be a mess. I don't use them in the morning because they don't have any SPF and I need that SPF because you can see through my skin. Okay, on to masks. This is, this is an, another sample. I'm telling you, I'm like legit a sample junkie. Fresh Black Tea Instant Perfecting Mask. This one, I'm almost done. I'm gonna be really sad when I'm done this because it's an expensive mask, I'm not gonna lie. But it's the only mask that I've ever used where it really is instant. I put this on, on on mornings that are a rough morning, I will put this stuff on. Do you mind airplane? If I ever wake up and one, I'm like really tired or my skin is just looking rough, needs a boost, I put this on and I, I actually rub it in just like I would a moisturizer almost. And it has a very interesting texture. It's like, um, it's a whipped texture. So it doesn't, it's a whipped, very silky texture. So it doesn't sink in all the way, but I do like to really rub it in to try to get it in on my skin. Some days I can leave it on for 20 or 30 minutes. And this is definitely one of those, the longer the better guys. So when I leave it in for a half an hour, my skin is like, great mask, very hydrating. My skin just looks like a million bucks afterwards. Ooh, onto the body products. Okay, so in the shower, I have I just did a post on this stuff too. I'm obsessed with it. This is this is my backup. I have like three of these in the in my closet. I look like a hotel closet. You know when you walk by the hotel um, where they get all the grab the supply closets in hotels. That's what my closet looks like. I look like a hotel supply closet because I have a million of these bottles in there. But a Walgreens just to buy one get one free and baby girl stocked up. So. This is my, this is one of my extra ones. I'm obsessed with this stuff. It's the Shea Moisture African Black Soap Body Wash. It smells amazing, it leaves your skin feeling so good. This is my, again, from DHC, cause I'm a DHC junkie. This is my, it's called a mesh foamer, I think. You're supposed to put your soap in here and then get it all nice and foamy and then use the foam to clean your face. But I use this as my body loofah. It's like, two or four bucks or something, they're super cheap. And I like because, see how there's only a little bit of mesh? I love that, because I hate how those, you know the loofahs that you buy at like Target, they're, and they're filled with, with the foaming mesh? I hate it because the, there's like just so much mesh, I feel like I'm holding on to like a cabbage. I'm like holding on to a squishy cabbage and washing my body with it. And it's too much. So I like this guy because it's just a little teeny bit of mesh, but it makes it so foamy and it exfoliates a little bit. Love it. So I put this in here and it's awesome. And my skin looks so dang good. And this stuff smells amazing and it's cheap. 10 bucks a bottle and I just got to buy one, get one free. And then for body, I also just tried a bunch of the Shea Moisture lotions. And this one has ended up to be my favorite. It is the Shea Moisture Baby Healing Lotion, and it is so good. You know what, while I'm here, I'm just gonna show you. I'm gonna go grab, since I have all my stuff out anyway, I'm gonna grab my sunblock. All right, I was saying that this is the brand La Roche Posay that I uh, use for my skin in the morning now. This, I use this product year round. This is La Roche Posay, I, again I cannot say this, Anthelios 45 Ultra Light Sunscreen Fluid SPF 45. This is the stuff that I tried one time. I can't even remember why I tried it. I feel like it was meant to be because I will get a burn within five minutes of being outside and it's just like a nasty, nasty sunburn where I just will fry right away. So I started using this stuff and I have not gotten a sunburn since. It's amazing. It feels on your skin. You shake it up like that. And then you put a little bit on your skin. I'm not going to use a lot right now. 
Look at that. Just like a nice silky matte. So those are all my favorite winter skin products. Thank you so much. I feel like they're all pretty easy to find as well. You don't have to really go to the ends of the earth to find any of those brands. So I'll link everything below. Check those links out. Check out the blog at Girl Get Glamorous. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.